say those words often to one another. Say, I love you. It needs to be said. Talk about your love constantly, but do not keep it with only words. Move on and show indeed how you love one another. Build that on truth. Give yourself for one another, serving one another, loving one another, and finally let that love be in truth. Every day discerning and building on that foundation. And I can promise you that your wedding day will be extended into your marriage as the most joyful experience that you can have as a human being. So my objective today is to make Katie cry, but also try and make as many of you cry as well. And I'll help you out by crying myself. So here are my vows. Katie, I remember you showed me how to hold a girl's hand four years ago. I appreciate your ability to pretend to understand my jokes even when they don't make sense. You're a super caring person. Ah, you're always... <laughs> Should we say it? <laughs> I got that. I thought that I would use this opportunity to provide you, to prove to you and everyone here as witnesses that I'm the funny one in the relationship and in this battle once and for all. But instead when I sat down and came to writing these vows, I couldn't come up with anything that would be funny and could, couldn't stop thinking about the great things you do for us. <laughs> like our very first date at Rosie, I sometimes still get butterflies with excitement when I see you. Your smile just lights up the room and your kind heart is filled with warmth and love. I've enjoyed every year, every month, every week, every hour, every minute, even if it's just sitting silently in a room doing our own thing. It makes me happy to have you there with me. Katie, you're truly an amazing person and I wouldn't be um, happier that you found your perfect match. And I just want to wish you both like all the happiness that this world have to offer and be kind to one another and just don't argue over little things like the flower pot. I don't know if you know. Yeah! <laughs> Katie's someone who is so generous and caring and always put others before. Um, her own to the point where she overthinks and lets her own truths take a back seat. So Ben, I hope you always put Katie first and double check what she's actually thinking. <laughs> You're a super caring person who always puts herself, herself last. I promise to be the one who to always put you first. I enjoy I enjoy spending time with you, especially when I get help. Uh, when I help you out on your spreadsheet for work, you challenge my thinking, ambitions, and interests, yet have rounded me into a better person. A person who is family oriented, one who is caring, one who enjoys the fundamentals of life. Sat on the hill, no one around. No, I can't tell if we're lost or we're found. We're standing still. On the we'll stay together as the rain falls down on us. Just us. The night it comes, the stars they fly. We lay and watch as the world goes by. Oh, <laughs> 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 <laughs>
that you really brought out the best version of myself that I didn't know or think I had in me. You are someone who is reliable, supportive, dependable, and trustworthy. But most importantly, you are one who I proudly call my best friend. Running through the pages of my heart Trying to find the places where you are <laughs> Because of these reasons, I want to declare to enter into a long life partnership. To laugh, to cry, to travel, to cook, to grow wrinkly together. Oh. Clap please, clap please. <laughs> Every time I close my eyes, I think of Everybody knows the saying, happy wife, happy life, but I think Ben's going to subscribe to more of a mildly annoyed wife, entertaining life. We all love you both very much, and we're all very grateful to be a part of your lives. And I want to finish on something a bit profound that you can take home with you tonight. It might make you think. Love. Love is like a fart. If you have to force it, it's probably shit. Number one, as there is someone new, the most amazing 12 secret spice is now in front of you. <laughs> Ever wonder what it's like? It's time to start a new. You have taught me a lot about life, light bulbs, and clocks, and plants. But the one thing I always remember is you taught me to be myself at all times and never tried once to ever change who I was or have any judgment. But instead, you embraced who I am and joined me on my goofiness. From here on in, I can't promise you that I'll cook for you every day because we all know here that I'm a pretty big amateur in the kitchen. But I vow and promise you I will always try every day to satisfy that value of yours. I can't promise you that I'll keep up with your pace when it comes to outdoor activities because let's face it, I am no athlete. But I vow and promise you I will always be behind you every step of the way in life and heights, even if it's 100 metres behind. I can't promise you that I will be as creative and critical thinking as you. Well, I just don't have that in me. 
But I vow and promise you, I will always support your ideas and vision. I can't promise you that I'll never stop arguing with you because I like to be right all the time. <laughs> but I vow and promise you, I will always stay and resolve it with you no matter how big or small. I can't promise you that I'll always make you laugh, but I vow and promise you, I will always make you happy with my unconditional love for you. I promise to be your best friend, consoler, navigator, and your wife. <laughs> I'm really excited and looking forward to our future. I know, and I know and confident that whatever life throws at us, it will be okay, and we'll get through it together, because we are one big, great group of all. I feel like I don't show you enough appreciation for the love you give me and happiness you bring in my life. So instead of our friends and family witnessing how funny I am, here today I want them to witness me declare my love and appreciation of all the things you do for me and the promises I made for our marriage. I know I don't say this often as I should, but I love you in the past, I love you now, and will always love you in the future. No matter what happens, just know that I'm here with you and love you till the end of time. I don't know about tomorrow. I just live from day to day. I don't borrow from the sunshine for the skies may turn to gray. I don't worry about the future for I know what Jesus said. And today I walk beside him, for he knows what lies ahead.